secret network of agents across the world using online tools to spy on, keep track of, and ultimately defeat their enemies. It sounds like the plot of the latest James Bond movie. Bond. James Bond. But it's actually recent claims made by a whistleblower who provided detailed information about methods used by the resistance that violate rules explicitly covered under the Ingress Terms of Service. In this video, we will delve into the claims made by a group called Clean Ingress, the functionality of the tools being used to cheat and the reactions from all sides of the Ingress community. Clean Ingress claims that thousands of players on the resistance team are cheating, violating the Ingress terms of service. This includes community leaders, anomaly POCs, vanguards who were picked and are compensated by the company, and even Niantic employees themselves. The Ingress Terms of Service states that players are forbidden to use software of any kind to scrape or data mine. The tools provided by the Brokers Guild violate those terms by scraping comms from the Intel map and storing it to a database codenamed Riot. Members can then search this database for detailed information about players and their activities. Members of the Brokers Guild have access to a wide range of tools and commands to help them find and eliminate guardians, stop large-scale enlightened operations, and tracking player movements and routines. Are a very particular set of skills. Skills I have acquired over a very long career. Skills that make me a nightmare for people like you. All a guild member has to do is type in a simple command to view a list of players' guardians. If they are not close enough to take it out themselves, they can then put a hit out on it with another command. Just do it. Clean Ingress has proof of these taking as little as an hour to perform. One hour to erase 149 days of work by another player. Another useful tool to help stop large-scale enlightened operations will alert the resistance of links over a certain distance being thrown near checkpoints, as well as when specific mods are deployed. This gives them a clear indication of when an operation is underway and a big advantage to stop it. There are also player-based tools that can display heat maps of agents' activities to see frequently visited portals and commonly traveled routes. If they travel outside of this area, they can trigger real-time alerts. So far, the reaction from the resistance is that of silence. From what we have seen so far in social media, the Brokers Guild members are not speaking up, except to deflect and point fingers at alleged cheating by the enlightened with similar comm scraping systems. And although the validity of this network might be questioned, some of the Brokers Guild members have confirmed the website to be factual. What about Niantic, the creators of Ingress? At the time of this video, there has been no official response from them on these claims. Niantic has made moves in the past to eliminate cheating, such as in 2014, there was a change in the Intel map which removed the capture time and discovery date entirely. Though these changes may have slowed down the development of Guardian tools, today, the next generation of tools scrape data from comms, which can then be saved in databases like Riot and kept forever. Ex-community manager for Niantic, Joe Philly, said, I don't care who does it or why, but hunting guardian portals is cheap and dirty. So, how will this affect the community? Are there more tools like this out there? How long before everyone gets sick of the cheating and quits? Will future networks of secret agents be the end of ingress? 
What is Niantic going to do about it? What do you think and where do you draw the line? Comment below with your thoughts and subscribe to Agent Academy for more Ingress videos.